I don't know much when it comes to love, I can't say much about it. Real cute with a good figure, I take interest in your body. Okay, so the first cop is the shoe of the year. Ain't no saving the best for last. I'm just gonna get this like right here on and popping. First shoe of the shoe of the year, you already know what I'm talking about, the lost and found ones. These shoes are all there and then some. I can't complain about these at all. I actually hit these on a raffle, so I did pay retail. I was not gonna pay retail. Uh-uh, I just went having it. I love these shoes so much that I picked them up two times. I actually got two pairs. I hit three raffles, but my bank account was only filling two raffles, unfortunately. You know how they go, but these are the lost and found ones, and these are indeed the shoe of the year. Um, okay, what you heard, these are the shoe of the year. And everything about this shoe was perfectly executed down to the box itself. Like, this shoe is giving very much what needs to be gave. The Jordan brand, they did not disappoint with this shoe. Next shoe are the Christmas release. These are the Cherry 11s. At first, I was not feeling this shoe because I thought they gave me Santa Claus vibes. I ain't gonna lie. Like, when I seen these shoes, I thought of St. Nick. But for some reason, they grew on me and they look so much better on feet than they do, like, on the pictures. But these are the cherry levels and I must I must say like this is a little hard look off. Ignore the little outside noise you hear about people down in this shoe. This is a nice little shoe. The only thing about this shoe to make me mad was the price tag. This shoe was $185, then with tax it was $18. Jordan brand, like I don't understand. I really don't understand. Like your price is way too high, y'all need to cut it. Ain't no way I spent 203 on a kid shoe. Ain't no way and I refuse to believe that like I made a child right now. I'm still gonna buy y'all shoes, but I made a child. I want to boycott child because this ridiculous two or three four kids shoe. Do better with y'all still. Next shoe are the most slept on shoe. These should have been in everybody top five pair of shoes of this year. I don't know why. I don't understand people's little logic, but these are the trophy one sevens. And this shoe right here, when I tell you, this shoe is all that and then some. Like the back, everything about this shoe is perfectly executed. I didn't hit on these, unfortunately, so I had to cop these off goat. That was less than 200, I believe. That was up my alley because I was bought these. That was 300 because they just looked that good. This is the whole thing. Down to the box, like this shoe is giving. Like, how many shoes you know? How many shoes you know come with a basketball court inside? Let's not play like you don't see that every day. And it also came with like the clipboard. It also came with like a clipboard. You fold the clipboard back, all the players and their numbers. Next shoe is another slept on shoe as well. These are the denim ones. And I don't know why these shoes did not perform well because these are so cute. These look so good with some blue jeans on. Like, mark my words, these look so good with some blue jeans on. I'm going to post my little picture like right here and show y'all how good I was looking. But I actually got these for under retail. I got these from Netta Porter. Netta Porter is a designer website that also um, sells like Nikes and Jordans. Yes, it's a legit website. If you don't wear designer, I just told you, I just put you on. But these are the denim ones. They did come with that little um little gold thing in the middle. I was not feeling it. And also came with a hang tag. I took that off because I wasn't feeling that either. But these are so cute as well. And these are a cute shoe overall. I think I caught these for no more than like 160. Next shoe are the Winter Solis Dunks. I know I didn't pronounce that right. I think it's called Winter Solis, Solis. But y'all get the point. These are the Winter Solis Dunks. And I caught these off of GOAT. I don't actually remember these releasing. I was just scrolling on GOAT one time because I wanted to spend me some money. And I saw these, I'm like, where had these been all my life? And these, this shoe right here, like, oh my God. OMG, like, my kid did the thing when they did this shoe. But I don't think these released this year, 2022. These probably released 2021. I don't know, but this is a cute overall shoe. Like, Go buy this right now. Like, you will not be disappointed. This is a good shoe to add to your collection. Okay, these should be my last two. And these are some dunks. I'm just going to get these out, out the way at the same time. These are the red plum dunks. And these are the peach cream dunks. One thing about these shoes, the peach cream dunks, these can be considered the poor man's um, laser orange dunks. I want the laser orange dunks so bad, but I wasn't feeling the price on them. I think they were going for $300. So, I feel like that's why Nike invented these. These are like the poor man's laser orange i don't mind them but these are so cute and these are the red plum dunks nothing major these are a pair of sbs so these are the whole thing thank y'all so much for watching the video period